The incomplete pictogram shows information about the number of cycles sold in a shop on Tuesday, on Wednesday and on Thursday. A total of 20 cycles were sold on Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. 8 cycles were sold on Friday. 15 cycles were sold on Saturday. Use this information to complete the pictogram. So in this pictogram, each one of these circles represents a certain number of cycles. So we want to work out how many cycles each one of these circles is equal to. So we've been told that 20 cycles are sold on Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. So we can start off by counting up how many circles there are in the Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday column. So we can start off by counting the number of circles there are in the Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday row. So there's one circle in the Tuesday row. There's two and a half circles in the Wednesday row and there's one and a half circles in the Thursday row. And if we add these up, this gives us a total of five circles. So this means that five circles on this pictogram is equal to 20 cycles. So if we do 20 divided by five, this tells us how many cycles each of these circles are equal to. So 20 divided by five gives us an answer of four. And this can form part of our key. So we can write that each one of these circles is equal to four cycles. And we can now use this information to complete the rest of the pictogram. So if eight cycles were sold on Friday, and each one of these circles on the pictogram is equal to four cycles, then this means we'll need to draw two circles to represent the eight cycles. So 15 cycles were sold on Saturday. So in order to work out how many circles we'll need to draw onto our pictogram, we can do 15 divided by four. So 15 is the number of cycles and four is the number of cycles which the key represents. And this gives us an answer of 3.75. So this means we'll need to draw out 3.75 of these circles onto the pictogram in the Saturday row in order to represent the 15 cycles. And this is what our completed pictogram should look like. Now this question's worth three marks, and we'll get all three marks for correctly completing the pictogram with the correct key.